This video is brought to you in part by Boutique FDB for all your miniature needs. And today I'm gonna paint Wong from Marvel Zombies. Hey there miniature fans, hope you're having a good day. I wanna thank you guys for being here and watching this video. So I primed uh, this Wong miniature, or bystander I should say, uh, with shark white. It's an air paint on top of a black primer. Uh, so we did a zenithal highlight, but this is a very, very uh, warm uh, white, okay? Like it's uh, one of the color triads in the air primer range. So it goes from shark white to yeti white to matte, uh, matte white. And I want to see how uh, speed paints work on different kinds of zenithal highlights. And this is why I did this one with a warmer one, uh, just to give it a more, uh, I, don't know, I don't know, more like authentic look or like a darker look. So I used some maize yellow there on the cuffs. Some gunner camo is up next on the pants, actually pretty much on the rest of this whole miniature. Like it's pretty much simple as miniature. You can't take long on this miniature. It literally took me probably uh, maybe seven minutes to paint this miniature in total, maybe eight max. Anyways, it's very simple, especially with P speed paints. It just gets the job done. Uh, the gunner camo is pretty good. It's a little darker than what I would have expected, but that's okay. I want to try it out and I haven't tried it yet. Going back to the old 1.0 version of speed paints, using some hardened leather on the shoes, and now using back some speed paint 2.0, some Carmine Dragon on the floor here. And at one point, I accidentally dipped my brush in the uh, hardened leather. So you're gonna see that I was like, "Wait a minute, this is coming out a little brown here," and then oh, up it is brown. So it's like, "All right, let's just cover it up." And you know what's cool? I actually re-put it in that Carmine Dragon and didn't even clean my brush and look at the red it's coming out the way it should be it like completely covered it up i just went back over those spots that i hit it with the brown originally and so again and it didn't reactivate or whatever so that's pretty cool and it was still wet so it was pretty good that it covered up very easily so dusk red now for the rest of that base i mean you can tell that this miniature is already finished here and i used peachy flesh at the beginning there for the face and the hands uh pretty cool color and with this kind of zenithal highlight it actually comes out pretty nice and you can see it's not like over the top zenithal highlight though so if you really want that the white would be better and there you have it folks wong a bystander from marvel zombies is painted and ready for the table i hope you enjoy these marvel zombies videos we're almost done with this box the corset uh we're gonna be moving on to other stuff some people have actually asked for marvel Un uh, united again i'm gonna get back to that as well i got some other miniatures i gotta paint so keep an eye out for those i want to thank you guys for watching hit that like button subscribe join the discord channel and we'll see you all in the next one